Hello guys, today I'm going to show you all the features on DirecTV now as well as sort of a review. So basically you scroll in here and this shows you what's on. Um, so, and then you just click on that. And then continue watching. As you see, this is what I've been watching. And then you got your list that you can add stuff on. I don't know why it's doing that. And then when you click on a show, it'll come up the seasons. So you just say season one. And then I'll show you the episodes. So always the top is the most recent episode and the bottom is the, the least recent. So keep that in mind. And it tells you, the, tells you the date it launched to. So that's something interesting. And you can read about it, the episode 2. As well as you can air it to your TV. Now we'll look. I don't know why it keeps scrolling down. Um, you can look at HBO highlights. As you see, here's some are. And we'll get into more of HBO a bit later. Um, you got DC Entertainment. This is, I think, is a new feature because I don't remember this being here. Um, they got Gotham. Yep, so this will be your new episode, so that's good. And then we'll dig into the TV guide as well as all your movies with HBO and the Star Networks and all that. So this does go down quite a bit. Um, and there you go, you've got HBO movies, Cinemax, and AT&T exclusive stuff. Um, there's not much in this. With the AT&T exclusive. Alright, now what we'll do, we'll first dig into the guide. So as you see it pops up down here, we'll just get rid of that. So you can look at your TV guide as well as you can look at your favourite channels. And as you see your favourite channels pop up there. And then you can go back to your all your channels and you can just scroll down. Now yeah, they're in alphabetic order so A to Z, so keep that in mind too. And then if you want to watch one of them, you just click it. And there, it'll go straight to the channel. So we're back out of that. Now we'll look at the show's options. So this will show you what's trending on social. And to see more of this, you just hit see all. And it'll give you a whole list. I like it this way because it's a lot better. Um, depending on what you guys like. Sometimes the pictures don't load up. Depending on your internet speed as well. Um... That can cause it not to load, the pictures load up. And that gives you a rough idea of what you get there. Now, this is the Happy Birthday Direct TV. Now, I believe this is shows they're giving you, even if you're not subscribed to their um, certain channels. So we'll see about that. I'm actually not sure if that's true, because I'm subscribed to most of these networks. Yeah, I don't know why it says that, because I'm subscribed to all that. Anyway, it's probably just telling you it's their birthday. It'll be their birthday. I think, yeah, it's their birthday actually today, because I think they launched on the 29th. Um, yep, and now we'll look at your movies. Now, this is the best option ever, depending on what you want. You can either go HBO or Cinemax, but I think there's an all option. Yes, yeah, this is what I normally go to, is your comedy. So there should be an all option. It's weird there isn't one. So we'll just hit all HBO. Now there is one advantage you do get with HBO and Cinemax. Is you can sign in with HBO Go on your TV. So that's pretty cool. And they're all in HD too, when you watch it on HBO Go. Same as if you watch it on DirecTV now. So yep, and then when you click on something, um, you can read about it. As well as you can see the cast in the movie too. And now we'll look at your networks. Now you get quite a lot. Now I'll show you the ones you're not subscribed to and I'll show you the ones you are. So first we'll hit see all, or show all. And these are all the networks you're subscribed to. 
So you can look at um, CBS, and it should show the available content that they have. So if you want to know how to get the CBS and it's not showing up, go on your networks and then click on um, um, CBS. And as you see, you click on something like this, and you can play it straight away down here. As well as you've got all the seasons, we'll see how many they've got. So they've only got the 10, and then you can see who's in the movie. And then we'll back out. So that's how you get to your CBS. So we'll continue looking at um, the networks you're subscribed to. You've got CW, and you've got a new one I don't know if you knew about, is DC. Now this is quite a cool one. This is with your Fox network, as you see when we click on it. I don't know why I did that. Okay. That's weird. Okay, I thought it said Fox. Okay, no. This is a special thing now. You've got exclusive with um, DirecTV now. Um, it's DC content, which is quite interesting. It's funny, there's no DC actual channel. So, yeah. As well, you'll see some networks here that aren't actually live channels. Um, I'll show you one, for example, in a minute. One is uh, Taylor Swift now. That's not a live channel. Same as this one over here. This one here. That's not a live channel either. So, we'll back out of that. So they've got DC, and uh, so that's pretty cool, and they've got much more. Now we'll show you the stuff that I'm not subscribed to, and this is how you'll know what channels you're not subscribed to. Now if you want Boomerang, you'll have to spend, get the $70 pack, which has got to have it all. I don't think it's particularly worth it. Um, yeah. Another channel I like is Destination America, but you'll need the $60 pack to gain access to that. And these are all the channels. Now, one annoying thing um, with Showtime at this current point, if you pay the extra $8, you only get one live channel, which is very disappointing. Obviously, I can't look at that. But as you see, if you stay with the $35 pack, I'd grab this advantage before it hits December. You can get it for $10. Now, that's really cheap. Um, $10. Now, that will only be for one month, I'm pretty sure. It'd be good if it was an exclusive offer forever. $10 until you cancelled. But no, they don't have that. But yeah, I just wanted to show you a quick sort of review on all the channels you get and so on. Hope you like it out. Hope you like it and hopefully we catch you in the next one. Now, if you want your name to be shouted out on our channel, put the hashtag on Twitter. Um, get better TV. Flat, um, get better TV community. Um, we'll have a, we've got it on, um, and it'll be on the screen, if you want your name to be in, our, every Friday, starting next week, your names can be called out and be um, sh shouted out on our channel, if you want to participate in that. If you do, check us out on over on Twitter, and you can have a look on how to apply. Alright guys, hopefully you like this video, catch you guys in the next one.